Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So about a month ago, as I posted, Microsoft fixed a long-time standing lag issue with the Microsoft Store, where they made it a lot faster when you launch the app, when you open the app on Windows 10 and Windows 11, because as many of you will know, previously, until they rolled out that update about a month ago, um, the store was very laggy and slow when you launched the app. Now, I'll leave that video down below if you would be interested. But uh, just to let you know that with the latest version that rolled out, which I posted on just a couple of days ago, version 22.3.1.1, which also brought and included the new instant games that let you play instant games directly from and in the Microsoft Store without having to download the game. Microsoft has also rolled out another small yet I think a significant improvement and bug fix with that update that addresses another long time standing issue where with the store update version 22.3.1.1 they've also resolved the issue where the library page only displayed recently updated and installed apps which now has finally also been fixed with this latest version upgrade that rolled out a couple of days ago and now you can see that if we scroll down it now shows all of the installed apps where previously uh, before this fix rolled out on a lot of occasions when I would launch the store it would only show uh, the recently updated or installed products and I'm sure a lot of you have no had noticed that as well and then I would have to close the app and then relaunch the store and then it would only show um, all of my installed apps and products and that now has finally been resolved. So just letting you know about that because I think that, as mentioned, is a small yet I think a significant um, bug fix that has rolled out with that latest version upgrade. And just on a side note, um, if you want to access all your previously purchased apps and games, not just all your installed apps and games, you can s click on this tab, sort and filter, and obviously you can just uncheck show installed products only, and that will show you then all of your previously purchased apps and games. And that's just... A quick side note uh, in case you didn't know but nonetheless i think the store is now much faster and that bug has been fixed now with your installed apps and games and i think that's a nice move as i would say in the right direction that improves the microsoft store a lot when it comes to uh, its performance and usability so thanks for watching and i'll see you in the next one